Morning, it's Michelle from the Palmyra Community Library. Thanks for joining us for a story time. If you have your snowflakes, why don't you grab your snowflakes and let's sing some songs. Dance like snowflakes, dance like snowflakes in the air, in the air. Whirly twirly snowflakes, whirly twirly snowflakes here and there, here and there. Dance like snowflakes, dance like snowflakes in the air, in the air. Whirly twirly snowflakes, whirly twirly snowflakes here and there, here and there. The flakes in the winter come falling down, falling down, falling down. The flakes in the winter come falling down all through town. The flakes in the winter twirl round and round, round and round, round and round. The flakes in the winter twirl round and round all through the town. The flakes in the winter go swish, 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 swish. The flakes in the winter go swish, swish, swish all through the town. The flakes in the winter come. Oh, did we already fall down, didn't they? What, let's see, I'm not really sure. Is it gonna be really cold out? When it's really cold, this, the ground kind of squeaks. So let's say squeak, squeak, squeak. The flakes on the ground go squeak, squeak, squeak. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Squeak, squeak, squeak. The flakes on the ground go squeak, squeak, squeak. All through the town. When I see your color, you can put it back in, the, uh, in your um, storage. The flakes in the winter are blue or purple, blue or purple, blue or purple. The flakes in the winter are blue or purple all through the town. The flakes in the winter are white and pink, white or pink, white or pink. The flakes in the winter are white or pink all through the town. Yay, good job. Well, I do miss seeing you all, so please stop by the library anytime to visit us. But um, here's a couple stories that I have to sh that I wanted to share with you today. The first one is called Stop Bot. And when they say bot, they mean robot. And the author is James Yang. Look at that paper. Or excuse me, look at the cover. See that giraffe? Oh, he's so cute. There's a lot of things going on in this book. So let's see if we can enjoy this via virtual. The end papers are... Looks like some cities. Looks like some tall skyscrapers. Stop, Bot! By James Lang. I have a bot. Do you see him right here? Here's his robot. All these people are looking down from their, their balconies or their um, windows. But, uh-oh, uh -oh, the robot went way up here. Stop, but. Hmm, let's see what happens. Everyone's looking. I'll get your bot. Up, 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 up the stairs he's going. Up, 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 all the way up. And he runs up the stairs. My broom may reach that bot. Hmm, that bot's just out of reach. Be careful hanging out the window there, guy. Can my fork and spoon snag your bot? Oh, so close. Again, just out of reach. See how it goes up, up, and soon the bottom down here. See, there's the broom right here. And here's this guy. He's still running up. Honk, this trombone will trap that bot. My glove, my glove can catch your bot. Oops. <laughs> A bot just brushed by me. <laughs> uh oh, what happened to her? Looks like the robot went right through her hair. See her hair? <laughs> That's silly, isn't it? That's silly bot. Who's next? Oh, giraffes are good at getting bots. Oh, look at 
go tell that giraffe is, but he still just can't reach that robot. My plant will take just a little bitty bite. Wow, look at that big plant. He's like, chomp. This usually works with my bot. Hmm, bananas? What do you mean? Hmm. Ooh, bananas. Look at who caught the bot. It's like a big guy on top of the of a tall skyscraper. I've got your bot. And he's going back down the stairs. Down, down. Balloon, stop! <laughs> Uh-oh, here we go again. Hope that guy has more bananas on top. We need more bananas. <laughs> oh, that's silly, isn't it? <laughs> Did you like that story? That story makes me laugh. And here's the balloon floating up in the skyscraper. Stop, balloon! I need my balloon! Here's the end papers, just more skyscrapers. What a great illustrations these are of the big city. Stop, bot! <laughs> I like that story, that's silly. Let's sing a song. Roll, roll, roll your arms as fast as fast can be. Do it now and let me see. Do it now with me. Clap, clap, clap your hands as loud as loud can be. Do it now and let me see. Do it now with me. Tap, tap, tap your toes as soft as soft can be. Do it now and let me see. Do it now with me. Now let's see you shake your legs. Shake, shake, shake your legs as fast as fast can be. Do it now and let me see. Do it now with me. Roll, roll, roll your arm as slow as slow can be. Do it now and let me see. Do it now with me. <laughs> good job, good job. Um, let's do five little snowmen. Show me your five fingers. One, two, three, four, five. Five little snowmen standing in a row. Wearing a hat, put on your hat, hat, and a big red bow. Tie up your bow. The sun came out, it shined all day. And one little snowman melted all away. Five minus one is four. Four little snowmen standing in a row. Wearing a hat and a big red bow. The sun came out. It shined all day. And one little snowman melted all away. Four minus one is four. One, two, three. Can you do three a different way? This one I'm using my thumb, my middle finger, and my pointing finger. Can we do our three middle fingers, our ring finger, our middle finger, and our pointing finger? Be like three. Or you could make three with your pinky and your middle finger and your ring finger. Anyway, it's right, but it's fun to try different ways. Or you can use your two fingers and have three with using your two fingers. Two hands, I mean, sorry. <laughs> you can make three with two, two with three, yeah, whatever. Two hands. One, two, three. Three little snowmen standing in a row. Wearing a hat and a big red bow. The sun came out, it shined all day. And one little snowman melted all away. Three minus one is two. Two little snowmen standing in a row. Wearing a hat and a big red bow. The sun came out and shined all day. And one little snowman melted all away. Two minus one is one little snowman standing in a row, wearing a hat and a big red bow. The sun came out, it shined all day, and one little snowman 
melt it all away. 1 minus 1 is 0 or none. Good job. Good job. Should we do two little dicky birds? Two little dicky birds sitting in a cloud. One name soft, the other name loud. Fly away, soft bird. Fly away, loud bird. Come back, soft bird. Come back, loud bird. Yay. Good job. Okay, let me read another story for you. It's called Hooray for Hat. And the author is Brian Wong. Hooray for hat! Look at all the animals that are going to be in this story. There's going to be a zebra and an elephant, a lion, and a turtle. Hooray for hat! See all the different hats they have on? <laughs> they all have really great hats on, don't they? Zebra has like a little birthday hat on. Elephant has a really great hat on. Of course, lion has a crown. And turtle has... Let's find a sombre. Sombre. Sombrero. That's what I was trying to say. Sombrero with a feather in it. So let's see what happens. <gasps> oh, look at the end papers. Aren't those gorgeous? It's so stripy. Great colors. Hooray for Hat by Brian Wong. When Elephant woke up, he was very grumpy. Urgh. Can you show me your grumpy face? Urgh. Look at Elephant's grumpy face. He looks angry. Mm, I can appreciate that. I've been waking up like that lately. I don't like this cold weather. The doorbell rang and Elephant stomped downstairs. Can you help Elephant stomp? Can you stomp your feet? One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And he yelled, go away, I'm grumpy. <laughs> he has like a little grumpy mark on top of it, above his head. Ooh, yikes. There was a present at the doorstep. <gasps> oh, surprise. Look how happy Elephant is. He unwrapped it. Elephant unwrapped the box. <gasps> oh, it's hard to stay grumpy now. Hooray for a hat. <laughs> that looks great. Look at the side. It has like a little cup holder, a bird poking out. Wow, that's a great hat. Hooray for a hat, elephant cheered. I will show Zebra. Look how happy he is. I love it. That's a gorgeous hat, isn't it? Hooray for a hat. Hmm, I recognize those hats. <gasps> but Zebra did not want to look at any hats. Go away, I'm grumpy, said Zebra. <laughs> now Zebra has a little grumpiness over his head. So Elephant gave Zebra a hat, and Zebra smiled. They both cheered, hooray for a hat. Can you cheer with them and say, hooray for hat. Let's show Turtle. Guess what? Turtle did not want to come out of his shell. Go away, I'm grumpy, says Turtle. Turtle, elephant gives Turtle a hat, too, and Turtle smiles, and they all cheer. Hooray for hat! <laughs> Can you cheer with them? Hooray for hat! Let's show Owl. Oh, I didn't know Owl was in the story. But Owl did not want to see them or their hats. Go away, I'm grumpy. Hmm, I bet you're going to guess what happened. <gasps> Elephant gave Owl a hat too, and Owl smiled, and they all cheered. Hoo, 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 hooray for hat! Hoo, 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 hooray for hat! They all cheered. Elephant, Zebra, Turtle, and Owl marched down the road to show Lion. Hooray for hats, they cheered. But Lion did not want any visitors. Go away, he said. I'm grumpy. So, Elephant gave Lion a hat too, but Lion was still sad. I love this hat, but I can't cheer while our friend Giraffe is feeling well. What can we do? Oh, Giraffe wasn't feeling good. Well, that's too bad. Let's see what happens. Hmm. So elephant, zebra, 
Turtle, Owl, and Lion made a surprise for Giraffe. Hmm, I wonder what the surprise is going to be. They marched to Giraffe's home. On the way, Lion started to feel better. And soon, and the sign right here in Giraffe's tree says, Do not disturb. Do not disturb. Giraffe felt much better. Hooray for hat! <laughs> Yay, they're all cheering and shooting. Oh, excuse me, it doesn't say for hooray for hat. It says hooray for friends. I'm sorry. That's even better. Hooray for friends. And Giraffe felt much better. <laughs> That's really great. I love that story. And there's a pretty ink paper. I think I love the story so much because it has such great colors in it. Um, last week, I think we played with our rattles. So let's grab our scarves and let's sing with that. The um, window, window, wind, I say, what are we blowing away today? Scarves, oh scarves, oh scarves, I say, I am blowing the scarves away, yay! Let's do that again. Window, window, wind, I say. What are we blowing away today? Scarves, oh scarves, oh scarves, I say. I am blowing the scarves away. Yay! Peekaboo, I see you. I see you hiding there. Peekaboo, I see you. I see you hiding there. This is the way we wash our face, wash our face, wash our face. This is the way we wash our face so early in the morning. This is the way we comb our hair, comb our hair, comb our hair. This is the way we comb our hair so early in the morning. This is the way we brush our teeth, brush our teeth, brush our teeth. This is the way we brush our teeth so early in the morning. This is the way we get dressed, get dressed, get dressed. This is the way we get dressed so early in the morning. Yay! Put your scarf way high in the sky. Popcorn kernels, popcorn kernels in a pot, in a pot. Shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them until they pop. Woo! Popcorn kernels, popcorn kernels in a pot, in a pot. Shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them, shake them until they pop. Woo! Good job, good job. Window, window, window. I say, what are we blowing away today? Scarves, oh scarves, oh scarves, I say. I am blowing the scarves away. Scarves away, scarves away, put your scarves away today. Scarves away, scarves away, put your scarves away today. Good job. It was really great seeing you guys this week. Um, for our grab and go kit, you're gonna get something that looks like this. It's a little promotion of our um, YouTube video. You're gonna get a lunch bag, so you'll need some, um, you're gonna need some glue and crayons for this project. And you're gonna get a lunch pail. And these are two robot arm antennas that put on their heads. You want to put it on top of his head like this, glue it on like this. Or actually, I would glue it in like this, right? Two antennas. Do, 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 do. And here's some arms. You can stick them right in here. And your mom or dad might need to help you with the glue because sometimes the glue is tricky. And they might want to put a little staple in here too. And then you put your arm in the fold here like that. And... oh. Here's his head, stick on his head, and here's a little body part, 
And then this is going to be the robot. Stop that bot! And hopefully this robot puppet doesn't escape from you like the one did in the story. And that will be your robot puppet. So you can stop by the library and get your own robot puppet and um, color it and assemble it. And then you can do a great puppet show. Before we go, let's grab our stuffed animal or our adult and give them a break, big hug about and a little cuddle. And we'll sing. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Great. Thanks, guys, so much for um, joining us today. And just a quick reminder that we do do Zoom bedtime story time. So you can um, give us an email and I can send you the link. And we meet every Monday night at 7 a.m. Or excuse me, 7 p.m. And on Thursdays afternoons, uh, we do grab and go kits for kids, elementary age and above. And those that starts at four o'clock and uh, watch our Facebook or social media pages to see what's going on every week also. Um, great again. It was great again. Thank you so much for joining us and we will see you next week or stop by and visit us at the library. Have a great day. Bye-bye.